It's 2am and you finally finished your song. You export that shit and play it back, but it sounds like it was recorded underwater in a fish tank. Nothing like what you heard in FL Studio. Sound familiar? Of course it does, because 90% of you are making the same mistakes over and over and over again. So without further ado, let's export our songs the easy way. No cap, before we get into exporting, we gotta talk about your audio playback settings because most of you probably have this wrong. And chances are, you're not getting the quality you should be getting. Go to Options, Audio Settings, and and then change the sample rate to 48,000. This is the sweet spot where you can get maximum quality without having to absolutely detonate your PC. And here's the real upside. You can still export to MP3 with this setting too, but we're not done yet because this next part is where 95% of artists get in a pickle. Go to File, Export, then Wave File. Right, so now you're gonna be faced with this screen with a ton of options, but don't panic because I'm gonna make it brain dead simple. Put the mode in full song, not pattern, not loop, full song. If you're exporting patterns, then you're wasting everybody's time, including your own. Tail, cut remainder. This just cuts the dead space at the end. You don't need 30 seconds of silence, trust me. Bit depth, 32-bit float. This is the highest quality you can get. Don't overthink it, just use it. If you want to export to MP3, just click this too, and make sure the byte rate is the highest. Now here's the big one that separates the pros from the amateurs, quality setting. Click on that drop down and set it to 512 point sync. Yes, this file is going to be massive. Yes, it's gonna take longer to export, but here's what no one tells you. This is the difference between your song sounding professional and sounding like it was recorded through a phone. And this one makes me want to punch a wall because it's so obvious yet everyone screws it up. You know that enable master effects checkbox? Check it. If you've got a master chain on your mix, EQ, compression, limiting, whatever, and you don't check this box, FL will export your track completely dry. And then that's when you sit wondering why your export sounds nothing like what you heard in the program. It's like ordering a burger and telling them to hold the meat. Pause. And now all you gotta do is export the song. So in summary, exporting all comes down to these four settings. 32 bit depth, 512 point sync, enable master effects, and stop overthinking everything else. And if you're still having problems after this, it's probably your mix, but that's a whole different conversation. So if you want me to help you make better music, click the top link in the description. Keep working hard, and I will see you at the top. Goodbye.